Hey everybody, it's Nick here from Grayscale Gorilla, bringing you another behind the scenes video of what we just added to Grayscale Gorilla Plus. Now we've had thousands of you join us here at Grayscale Gorilla Plus, and if you've been thinking about it as well, definitely check out this video. This is one of our biggest launches ever, so let's get right at it. Let's go see what's new. So there's a lot of places we could start, but let me start with something I'm very excited about, and that is that Lightkit Pro is now included in every Plus membership. This is something we've been working very hard to get to you guys, and I'm so excited that it's just, it's finally here. You can go download this today, start using this if you are a Grayscale Gorilla Plus member. It is included. Now, uh, if you're familiar with Like It Pro, you know that this is the easiest way to get studio lighting inside of Cinema 4D, and it's just beautiful quality. Uh, we worked really hard to replicate studio quality lights so that you can get these looks inside of Cinema. And what's great is the latest version works in Arnold, Octane, Redshift, and Physical Render. So if you use any four of those renderers, you get um, matching lights, which is really, really nice in production. We've noticed that a lot of uh, production houses, a lot of studios are mixing and matching different renderers. So that means you can start in one render and switch over to another one without losing your light quality. So that's all built in. You can get started using Lightkit Pro today. Download it, start using it. And in fact, let me give you a quick demo of Lightkit Pro. We already have a scene ready to go in Octane, and it's this easy to change your lighting using Lightkit Pro. Now, of course, let me just back out here. You can adjust any of these lights and move them around. We have our psych backgrounds. You can do all of this by hand, but we have some incredible presets to get you started. So this means you can double click on your studio, or you can come up here to Grayscale Gorilla, Lightkit Pro Plus and go to your browser. Once you have the browser open, you can choose from any of these presets. There's over a hundred presets here designed by professional studio lighting artists in 3D to help you get a kickstart. So check this out. All you have to do is uh, double click one of these. Let me uh, double click simple top. You can see it's gonna load the lighting and it's gonna pop up here in uh, your renderer ready to go and it will recognize what renderer you're using and set it to be compatible with that render. Now from here, if you don't like the lighting, you can simply open that browser back up. But if you do like the lighting, you can now start to uh, add your materials in your scene and start to customize your object. I'm just dragging some materials here that are also included with Plus. These are the Everyday Material Collection materials. And uh, in fact, if I wanted a marble uh, coffee maker, I could do that as well. Let's add some glass here to where this carafe is. And you can see how quickly you can get set up with a product render using Lightkit Pro. It is designed to work quickly. So if you have not used Lightkit Pro, definitely go uh, download it and start using it today. All right, speaking of Lightkit Pro, we also have some new training just dropped inside of Grayscale Gorilla Plus called Studio Lighting with Lightkit Pro. And in this video, Nick V shows you how he lights these uh, studio headphones using Lightkit Pro. And he shows you different techniques and how he sets stuff up, it gets a nice alpha render. It's awesome, awesome training. Definitely check it out if you're downloading Lightkit Pro. Now there's a ton of new training uh, in this drop, so let's uh, let me show you the next one here. This one's called Tech Lighting 101. So if you want to dive even deeper on how to get beautiful studio quality product rendering, definitely check this one up. This one dives a little bit deeper on how to set up your project, set up your render uh, uh, render settings, and really build a project all the way through that is all about tech lighting and making products look beautiful. So you can see this one's a little bit more robust, take a little bit more time to go through, but Nick did an incredible job showing you uh, some of his tips and tricks on how to create this beautiful render here. Okay, so even more training. Let me show you this one. This one's called Warp Text, and this is a really simple yet beautiful technique that our buddy Jake Allen made a tutorial for, and he shows you how to take any image and make this nice warping effect. In fact, I think I have the, the final render here. And you can see, you could take any image and bring this in to get this beautiful kind of like warping effect in Cinema 4D. So for those of you who want a little bit more MoGraph stuff and maybe less product rendering, definitely head on in and check out this piece of training. All right, 
So much stuff. Let's keep going. We have dust. So starting today, all of our dust elements are also included in plus. You can go download these today, start using them. And if you haven't used these in the past, this is a unique collection. Now, of course we have 4K 2D overlay dust that you could use on any render, on any video footage, and you could add this stuff and put it on top of your footage and get this nice natural um, uh, dust look. But the real power, I think, comes when you bring dust into your 3D render directly. It means that your camera flies through it and you can get these really beautiful uh, dusty looks. It adds a nice depth of field look if you're using that. It obviously adds a sense of atmosphere. And man, I just throw this stuff in whenever I want that kind of moody look. What's next? We got a Q&A, friends. So every month, uh, Chad and I have been trying to do a Q&A uh, with Plus members. And this means this is for any questions that you might have uh, about your career, uh, maybe about your uh, software or hardware. We always get a ton of questions in our Slack channel. And if we wanna dive deeper into those topics, we do that on this show. We also answer your questions directly. And in fact, in this episode, we even do a deeper dive on what our roadmap is for Grayscale Gorilla Plus. So definitely go check this episode out. Of course, if you're a member, hop into your account, you're gonna hit your customer portal, click Access Plus Portal. And this is where you're gonna find all of the new stuff. And this goes with not just this month, every time we add new stuff to uh, Grayscale Gorilla Plus, we're gonna try to let you know on this page. In fact, right here you can see latest news and updates. We have your Like It Pro, we have tech lighting, we have um, the warp text, we have the headphone uh, uh, training as well. So. If we have new stuff, look for it here. And we're also uh, have a coming soon area where we're teasing stuff that we're working on or plugins that are coming soon, for example, transform next month. So definitely come here to your plus area, bookmark this page because this is literally your hub, your portal to all things Grayscale Gorilla Plus, including the plus plugins hub. Um, many of you have been asking, uh, about R23 and Plus plugins. If you uh, uh, if you are a Plus member, head on into this hub and this page will show you everything. It'll have all the directions and show you exactly how easy it is to install and start using uh, these plugins right now. And of course, if you're a Plus member, don't forget you also have your downloads area. So this is where you'll find your dust, your material collections, uh, Gorilla Grade LUTs, Texture Kit Pro, your Happy Toolbox sample pack, and other things that we're adding in the future will be in your uh, materials and downloads area. So don't forget about that as well. And if you're not a Plus member, please come check it out. We have been extra busy adding brand new stuff all the time into Plus, uh, including some awesome training that is exclusive only to Plus, you can't buy it separately. Um, and by the way, if you're watching this far and you're not a Plus member, you can go to training.grayscalegorilla.com and you can literally browse around all of the training that is currently inside of Gorilla U. Uh, over 500 hours and growing every month, it seems. We're adding new stuff here. There's new short tutorials, quick tips, long form tutorials, all the guides to X particles, Redshift. We have uh, a robust Arnold training. We have some new Octane training from David Ariaf. So if you haven't seen this page, come browse it. And if you're looking for something in particular, go to all courses and you can do a search and you will search over 500 hours of videos. Or if you're really feeling uh, uh, like you got a couple extra minutes, <laughs> scroll through all of this stuff and you'll get a taste of exactly what training is inside of Grayscale Gorilla Plus. You don't need an account or anything, just come to training.grayscalegorilla.com. Thanks for watching everybody. And if you are a Plus member, I wanted to thank you for joining. We've seen thousands of you join recently and it has been awesome to see you guys start using these uh, material collection, these plugins and this training. We love hearing from you guys. And if you're not a member yet, you should know that we also now have monthly pricing. This is something many of you have asked for in the past that we didn't have before. Well, we have it. Go check it out. It's at grayscalegorilla.com slash join plus. 
Go learn about it, and we cannot wait to see you inside of Plus really soon. Did my voice cut out? <coughs> you know what? I'm keeping that take. There was so much stuff inside of Plus, my voice went out. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and we'll see you in another video really soon. Bye, everybody.